What's going on guys, Chris here. Got another Beetle update for you. So I'm going to be doing all the front shot and beam today, getting that painted and hopefully get it all assembled in this video. The video is going to be over a few few different days. So I'm going to thought I'd get like one nice long video out for you instead of doing like loads of little short ones. But I just want to take a second to thank all the new subscribers, really appreciate it. We've got over 200 subs now. So sit back, enjoy, and enjoy this new episode. Bye! So this is where we left off last time. The beetle's sat on the pan now. It's only a temporary sat on, there's nothing bolted down yet, no gaskets are on. And then today I'm prepping all the front stuff. So I've got all the beat all the um, control arms, all the new ball joints in. I've got the shortened beam and then the um drop knuckles. So I'm gonna prep all these, get them in some epoxy, and then get some 2K on them as well. That's all the beam prep now. Went over to 320 and some Scotch brights. Then all the parts over here. So the next time you see them, should be in epoxy. That's two cuts of the epoxy on now. Let these tack off for a little bit, and then we're going to put the 2K top coat on. That's two coats of the 2K paint on now. I was going to let it tack off, I'm going to do one more coat on. It's starting to smooth out now because a lot of these parts are textured. So there's the beam, it's been about 2 or 3 days now, all nice and dry. Got all the arms as well, with all the new ball joints. And I've got the knuckles over there.
that's all the front beam on now anyways. Got the discs on. But we ran into a little problem because I'm running the teledials. The um that's how much steering we get without it hitting the arm, so I either have to run a spacer, which beats the object of running a narrow beam, or look in some different offset wheels, which I was going to change them anyways. So, because I want to go, go a little bit lower than this, and if I go lower it hits even more, so I have to raise it up, but even raising it up, I just think there's no engine in it at the moment, or no interior, no glass or anything, it's just sit quite low still. Good to see it back on its wheels finally. Make it underneath. And then we can finally start on the bodywork. Get rid of all this, I've got a new front end for it. Got a new apron. And this is what I'm doing today. Just gonna paint the new the brand new calipers. I've already stripped all the pins out of them and the pads out of them. Just gonna paint them in like uh, the grey. Then we get all the brakes fitted. Start running brake lines. Well, that's all I got for you today, guys. So, next video, we're going to be putting all the calipers on, doing all the steering box and all the steering arms and everything. So, thanks a lot again for all the new subscribers. Really appreciate it. And stay tuned for the next one. See you later. Bye.